hey guys it's lexi welcome back to another video so today's video is gonna be a day in my life vlog um i have posted on my instagram like you know what like what kind of videos would they like to see more of on my channel and the girlies was like day in my life vlog and i'm gonna hold you i've been wanting to do it but it's just like i don't be having much going on in my day y'all it's either i'm working I don't go to school. That's it. But anyways, today's Thursday, so I do have class today. So I was going to show you guys, you know, me getting ready for class, going to class and all that. And afterwards, I was going to stop by Target just to pick up, like, one thing. And then that's really it. I only have one class today. So I only have class, um, what's it called? Mondays and Wednesdays. Mondays, I have two classes. Wednesday, one. So I'm about to go brush my teeth, wash my face. Yeah, I'm about to go and brush my teeth, get in the shower, you know, do all that little stuff. I want to show y'all real quick, though. I've been using this new uh, face soap. I, I'm i going to put the information for this in the description box because my mom actually, like, I guess she be following this, this lady who sells skincare on Instagram and she got stuff. Yeah, so she got skincare from this lady on instagram that i guess she be getting skincare stuff from and she got me this turmeric bar so first of all how cute is this like, this is so cute but y'all i'm gonna just say this right now i've been sleeping on turmeric like i feel like if you haven't i know y'all be seeing all on tiktok the girls be using them the turmeric face wash thing or whatever i'm telling you right now turmeric is it like it's really it like when i tell you i really do feel like i started to see a difference in my face i only started using this like two weeks two two and a half weeks three weeks i think like literally when i came back from puerto rico is when i started using it so yeah three weeks no actually four weeks it's been four weeks actually i've been using it for a month now and i feel like my skin tone is definitely getting more evened out i still kind of have a tan from puerto rico so you know i'm not gonna fully be able to see the full results but even with just me having the tan, the tan fading out, I feel like my skin tone is getting more even. So, I'm definitely going to put the information for wherever she got this from in the description box because I love it. Like, I'm in love with it. But um, anyways, yeah, y'all. So, let me hop in the shower, do all that real quick. Alright, y'all. So, <laughs> I literally just got the shower, finished washing my face and stuff. So, yeah. I don't know why, but I feel like people don't be talking about elf skincare like that because I like it. More specifically, the hydration line. Like, y'all know I bought this when I went, when I was in Florida. And y'all, look how much is left. Like, I'm going to have to buy another one soon. But I was like, you know what? Let me try the toner. I like the lotion. Let me try the toner. So this is the... Keep your balance toner with hyaluronic acid, witch hazel, and aloe, which I like. And basically, it says that it helps remove impurities, refreshes the skin, and works to keep your skin looking healthy and balanced. Um, I wasn't really a toner person. Like, I honestly, wash my face, lotion. Like, that was it. I And I don't know. It's weird because I seen a TikTok and of, like, dermatologists and stuff, and they were saying, like, toner really actually isn't necessary like toner doesn't really do anything but then again it's like i don't know because when girls be using toners and stuff their skin don't be looking like my skin don't be looking like how their skin be looking so i was like should i get it should i not before i was using this the sea breeze this is like old school like i feel like everyone used to use this back in the day but some people were saying that it's not good for your skin some people were saying it is good for your skin for me personally, it's good. Like I definitely see a difference in my skin every time I use Sea Breeze. Like I don't know what it is, but my skin is always clear. It's always even, smooth, glowy. Like I like Sea Breeze. It works good for my skin. So I'm not gonna stop using it because at this point, at this point, people love to talk down these old school products, but 
Nine times out of ten, them old school products be the ones that be working better than these new ones that they be having coming out, literally. Half the time, the new ones literally be the same thing as the old ones. Half the time, the new ones be having the same ingredients as the old ones, but they just put on all these fancy names to make it seem like it's not, but it really is. I'm on to y'all. I'm on to y'all. But, anyways, yeah. I'm saying right today, y'all. Well, last night, some girl wanted to get me tight on my channel because on my team, my team haul. She got a comment under the video like, oh, the way you say Drew. See, it's making me mad right now because I don't even want to say the word, but I don't care. She said, she was like, oh, the way you say Drooly triggers me. Okay, so why are you watching my video? Like, I don't understand people like that. Like, because even, even on TikToks or videos, you know, when people be eating or when people talk, they be like, oh, the way you chew triggers me. So why are you watching the video? Like, I don't get it. Got me tight too because it's like, girl, I'm from New York. Brooklyn more specifically and we have an, as an accent when we talk same way how people down south have an accent we do also like half the time when I be watching people from down south and they be talking I be like huh huh like, I don't even really understand they have the time what they be saying but I'm not gonna sit there and like try to judge them for that because they have an accent. So, of course, the way they pronounce words or enunciate it is not going to sound like how I think it should sound. <laughs> the hell? Like, if you from New York, you know. And I don't even have, I feel like, I don't even have, like, an ill New York accent. Like, there's people out here with the illest, the illest New York accent. So, where we go? Like, I don't, I just don't understand that. <laughs> like, if it triggers you, why are you continuing to watch the video? And it's like, you know what I did? I deleted the comment. Yeah, I did. Because me, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not the type of person to go back and forth with people on the internet. You're just going to get blocked. That's it. Not even on the internet. That's in like real life too. When I'm having a conversation with someone and I don't even care to even continue the conversation, go back and forth, I'm going to block you. I, I, any time I got an argument and I will block you while you're typing, I don't care. Okay, I, like, I don't, I, I'm, I don't know, I don't know if it's the Aquarius in me, but I just don't be having an interview. And it's like, you're on my channel, trying to pop ish. You cannot cut, this is my channel. My channel, baby girl. Okay, I moderate what's going on here. So yeah, anytime I feel like there's a comment that I don't like, I just delete it. Because I do want to respond. I do want to respond, but yeah, I'm trying to keep it professional, you feel me? Trying to keep it professional. Especially in this day and age, every second they want to cancel you for something. Lord knows what. I don't know. As if people aren't human. Like, I know there's some things, you know, that, okay, like, nah, that's OD. You got to get canceled for that. But it's like, they be trying to cancel people for, like, basically having an opinion. Which I don't understand. It's weird. So, that's why I just keep my mouth shut. And you'll just get blocked. That's it. So, before I even think about comments or anything negative... Just, I'm gonna let you know right now, baby girl, you're gonna get blocked. <laughs> you're gonna get deleted and blocked, so don't even try it. But anyways, I'm putting on some sunscreen. Oh yeah, I've been using this too, this Ambi Even and Clear Fade Cream. This. I got it from my B Spot store. And it has niacinamide, vitamin C, and aloe vera. It's basically, it helps to correct dark spots and uneven skin tones. So, yeah. So, okay, I don't know like me like nowadays for my skin like my skin is clear like it's always been clear I never had issues really with acne or anything of that sort my issue with my skin is like it's I feel like it's not even all around like around here is darker where else is darker like right here on my nose it's a little darker um yeah I feel like there's certain spots is just darker than others and I don't like that so, so far I do like the Ambi. I feel like it is working. Um, yeah, it's my hair. Oh my God, I cannot wait to get a retouch. A touch up next week. Cause this is outrageous. Having sisters, bro, like I could never find anything. Okay, they always just taking something and not putting it back where it freaking belongs. All right, but yeah, I'm getting a touch up next week. Cause whew. I don't know how people be stretching their relaxers for like six months. Oh no, baby, no. Three months is enough for me. 
<laughs> like, cause my roots they get so. It's not even about like you know, the curl pad or anything like that. No, it's because my roots get so freaking thick, and my hair is already thick itself. Like, so my roots get so thick, and I just like, oh my god. But yeah, I think I'm gonna do like a mid, mid sit back. I don't know if it's just me, but top knot buns. I always used to want to be them girlies who wear them, you know, these are them top knot buns. Like, oh, oh, I thought it spilled out. Oh my gosh, thank you, Heavenly Father. Take your, thank you, Jesus. All right. Like, you know how them girls be doing them top knot buns? I always want to be like that, but. I don't know, like my head shape, I don't think it's meant for top knot buns. Same way how my head shape is not meant for um, two pigtails. Because I look like a freaking bowling ball with two buns sticking out my damn head. But um, where is this going to too? Like, y'all can comment down below what more videos would y'all like to see. You understand? Because I wanted to know. I do want to do like the week, the week in my life. But like I said, y'all, nothing happened. <laughs> really during the week for me i mainly do stuff on the weekends but now since summertime over and it's fourth quarter it's time to lock in so i'm not trying to really be go i'm not trying to really go out too much because <sighs> i like to play my birthdays early because you know i realized i realize my birthdays go well but i just do stuff from months earlier like, I literally be getting stuff done for my birthday around October, November. And my birthday is all the way in February. And I know y'all may feel like, girl, come on now. Like, that's mad early. But I'm telling you, I, I literally have to. Because December is Christmas. So, January, you think I'm going to get stuff? I'm basically popped after Christmas. January, you think I have money and time to be trying to figure stuff out right after Christmas? No yeah no then um comes here comes February so I learned when I plan my birthday months ahead it goes right so I have to get my of course I'm going away I feel like I'm just at this point that's what I'm gonna do for every birthday go away go away go away I'm tired of the dinners like no no I'm tired of that so every birthday, I'm going away. So I have to get my uh, ticket next month. I want to get that next month. So in November, I can stack up November, most of December, to you know get Christmas presents, which is good. So January, that leads me to like get little things or whatever I guess you could say that I would need for my birthday, like you know outfits hair whatever 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 but yeah that's how i do my birthdays that's why when y'all girls be like i never had a good birthday like it's always something going wrong let's be real let's be real it's because y'all be planning last minute and now trust me i used to be one of those i definitely used to be one of those always planning last minute but i'm telling you right now the trick is if you want your birthday to go right plan it months ahead i'm telling you things sleek i will leave my hair out like in the ponytail like this but i'm i don't know i'm gonna just do the bun yeah, i think i'm gonna just do a bun because all right you guys i just put my clothes on all i'm wearing is this essentials hoodie some leggings <laughs> yeah i just tied my hair so i'm gonna take it out simple nothing, nothing, nothing too much so for my scent of the day you know I put deodorant and lotion on all that so first I use this body oil that I got from the respy store it's white diamond and it smells really it smells really good so I literally just bought that the other day and to top that I use this the Valentino I don't know the name but y'all yeah, know this one like I feel like everyone knows that one so yeah, 
And then just to layer, I'm gonna use this um, body spray that I got from 99 cent store. This, this. Yeah, don't be sleeping on some of them body sprays from like 99 cent store and stuff because not all of them have that cheap smell. And some of them actually are good to use as a layering perfume. Like I like to use this to layer. Like it's a really soft scent. So that's why I like this one. But um, let me get my bag together. Yeah, I barely have anything in my damn bag. I have my notebook. Um, some wipes, lotion, pens. Yeah, I recently just got the NYX Fat Lip Oil, and why did y'all hype this up? Why? Because it's not, like when you apply it, it's mad stiff. And I feel like it's thick to the point where it's not even glossy. I don't know, I'm not a fan of it, but I bought it, so I have to use it. But I'm really not a fan of it, like, I don't know, like, the beauty supply store has way better lip oils than that. But, um, headphones, yes, I use wire headphones, I do have AirPods. But they, I don't have really time to charge AirPods, charge my phone, all that. So I just bring my wire headphones, you know, keep it old school. So this is the phone runners that I'm gonna wear. I'm so mad that it's getting cold out, like, I hate the cold. I really do. I don't mind fall. Fall's not bad, but I know that after fall is winter. And I hate winter. I hate it. The cup of the day that I'm gonna bring is this. Oh my gosh, y'all. No, I didn't make a video. I mean, I made a video on my um TikTok. So my TikTok is the same name as my YouTube, Black Styles. Go watch that. And I just gave like a little haul and y'all. I bought this cup from Starbucks because they had a sale, 25% off. Do y'all see this? Like, it don't even go on my outfit, but I don't care. Like, this is a beauty. She she has to be shown. And I also got two more. All right, yeah. So, yeah, I also picked up these two from Five Below. Y'all, Five Below be having the same things. The same thing for five dollars. Like I'm not spending twenty dollars each time on a Starbucks cup, so I do be getting them far below. I know this one will go on my outfit more, but like I said, I'm sorry, I had to just today she she gonna get shown. So that's the cup I'm gonna bring. I'm just gonna fill it up with some water. All right, you guys. So I'm leaving out of class now. This is my school. I took a picture. Hmm? To go to Target, cause it's literally a Target right next to my school, but my boyfriend's rushing me. He, cause he's picking me up, so he has. What? Yo, this lighting. He's picking me up, and he's so, he, and he has to do something. So I don't know if I'll be able to stop at Target. I doubt it. So I'm gonna just get my food. But, all right, you guys, I'm in Panda Express. I'm gonna just get, I think I'm gonna get the orange chicken. I just got that recently and I like it, it's calm. Usually I eat, dang, I don't know the name of it. It's beef something. I usually eat that and that's really good, I like that, but. I'm talking to my YouTube. <laughs> but I think I might get the chicken. I don't know, I might get the beef though, cause I got the chicken last week. But yeah. Uh, class was calm though, like boring, boring. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna show you how to pull. Hello, can I get two bowls? Um, one with rice, one with lo mein. Um, the orange chicken. Both? Yeah. Anything else? That's it. Alright, you guys, so change of plans. I'm actually gonna take an Uber. So I'm in Target now. 
I always want to get the bloom. I know the bloom powder thing. Yeah, I seen they sell it at Target now. So I wanted to get it. But I do not know where. Wow, yeah, this is literally the last one. But it's a small one though. I don't mind. But at least that gives me time to try it out. This small one is $37. Because I feel like I don't have the energy. And I feel like, oh, this is a mango. I want to try the berry. I heard the berry one is good, but I'll try mango. All right, you guys. So it's literally a couple hours later. Like, literally, when I got home from school, I went, yes, yes, you go to Pan Express Target. After I left and I came home, I took my school clothes and I said, you know what, I'm going to chill a little. Like, I've been working for down all day, all that. Let me just take a little break. Yeah. Well, that little break turned into, like, a six-hour nap. Like, y'all, it's literally 12 in the morning. Which, hence, is the reason why I'm even in the bathroom right now. Because I don't even feel like turning on a ring light and doing all that in my room. Like, that's just too much. I literally, the only reason why I'm, I'm still tired. After that, literally, the only reason why I'm up is because I said, Oh shoot, I forgot, I didn't freaking finish the video for y'all. But I did want to taste the boom thing that I got from Target because it's the only reason why you want to Target. I know y'all seen this, but everyone should know what this is. Y'all seen it all over TikTok, all that. It says it has greens and superfoods and it helps with digesting, bloating, and energy. I mainly got it for energy because as you can see, <laughs> y'all like, at first, you know, I took it as a little joke, like, yeah, I'd be tired, I'd be tired, but now it's really serious. Like, I wake up, it doesn't matter what time I go to bed, I go to bed early. I wake up tired, I work, I'd be tired. I go to sleep, I'd be tired. Like, you ever just feel like you're like, like, like a freaking like zombie? Like, that's how I feel literally 24 seven. Like, I feel like a literal, zombie like yo i can literally fall asleep at any second just like this so it's like i'm like no i can't work like that because this like bro i have to i have work i have youtube you guys and i have school i don't have time to be tired every second of the day like i honestly do not have the time so it's like i know i try to take vitamins but I personally me I do not like to taste the vitamins. I feel like they taste like freaking medicine. It doesn't even matter what flavor I get. They just have like this weird like medicine aftertaste and I cannot stand it. Like that is the reason why I don't take vitamins because I really hate that aftertaste. So this I'm like, okay, well, it's basically like a juice or whatever. And I'm like, at least it has like greens and stuff and superfoods. So I'm like, this is basically vitamins. If you hear running back and forth, that's my dog. Please ignore him. It basically is like vitamins, but in powder form. Because I'm, no, like serious. Even, I might have probably be like, oh, you know, drink some water. I do that. I drink water. Like, I go to bed at a reasonable time. Even just now, I took a nap and I'm still tired after the nap. Yeah, this one is really not even funny. It's not funny. Like, the only reason why I'm even up right now is because I have to finish this video. Or otherwise, that nap wouldn't even have been a nap. I would have just been knocked to the next day. So it's like, yeah, no, it's really bad. Like, I can't. But anyway, this is the mango one. I wanted to get the berry, but this is literally the last one they had. But I heard the berry one was good. Mmm. This does not smell like anything like mango. So, first of all, first of all, first of all, $30? Why isn't this shit filled? <laughs> Why isn't it filled to the top? Like, literally, do y'all see that? $30? You can't even fill it to the top. Okay, let's put that in here. You know, I should have got two. I mean, not that serious, but... You know the 
those little machines that people be using to like froth their um milk and stuff in their coffee i forgot the name of it but yeah that It's not, it's not, <laughs> it's not disgusting, right, but I don't know how to, how to explain, like, it literally tastes like I'm tasting like, like I'm drinking like mango lip balm. Like you ever have like a a lip balm and you taste it and you're like Ugh. like that's literally the taste that I'm getting from this like I might have to mix this with some juice but if I mix it with juice it's gonna be like a natural juice like you know not no artificial sugar kind of juice no but yeah I'm gonna have to drink this with some juice I'm not even gonna lie to you because I, it's the aftertaste for me it's really the aftertaste I can't I don't know I can't put my finger on it I just do not like it. I don't know. I don't know if I hold my nose when I drink it. I don't know. But that's really... That's really it for my day and whatnot. I would show y'all me brushing my teeth. You know, doing all this yada yada and then the third. I'm going to be real with y'all. I do not feel like setting the my ring light right now. One, my ring light is literally broken. Like, I literally have to position the wire a certain way, and it shuts on and off on its own, so I have to order on the ring light. And two, it's 12 in the morning, I have to get up for work. And guess at what time? Eight in the morning. Yes, 8 in the morning. So I know if I sit here and I record and everything else, like, it's going to take me, like, about an hour or whatever, and I can't. Because for some reason, when I record... It takes me longer to do normal things that I do when I'm not recording. Let me know if that ever happens. See if y'all are a YouTuber or a content creator or anything like that. Y'all see me do all that multiple times. But, <coughs> but um, yeah, that's really it for my day. I'm definitely going to try to do more of these. But like I said, I want, me you know, as a content creator, for me, I don't know, in my head, I've been wanting to give y'all content you know some people like there'll be some people out here that literally would do like one thing throughout the whole day and then the rest of the video them is and the rest of the video is of them at home just talking like on to the camera i could do that but it's like i feel like as a beginner i have to give my audience something first yeah i get to know me i get to film me and then i can get more comfortable and do those kind of videos you understand but right now i feel like i want to give y'all something to watch but I feel like most of this video I did chat a lot more than I usually do. So if you like that, let me know. I know some people don't like talking videos. Some people like talking videos. Because me personally, I like it. Because I feel like you get to know the person more that you're watching. You know, it feels more authentic. I don't know, some people some people like to see content only. So, yeah, y'all have to let me know. I'm working with y'all, okay? But um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn on your post notifications for every time I post. And I'll definitely see you guys in the next one.